Hey guys, so this is actually the second time that I'm trying to record this video. So it may be a tad bit quick because I'm trying to get this video done. But anyhow, so this is the um, Black Friday shopping that I did 2018. Um, it was a fun time. It was easy. I had no problems getting in and out of the stores that I needed to. I know a lot of times people are afraid to go Black Friday shopping. They think it's a lot of chaos. They think that breaks, fights break out because sometimes you see people posting pictures like that online or videos. But that stuff is very, very far for you in, in between. Most of the time it does not happen like that. And now that they have the stores opening up on Thursday night, really they don't, you know, it don't happen like that most of the time so <laughs> to my right of me is my tv i did pick up two tvs from walmart um i went to walmart i went to uh, victoria's secret i went to jc penny's macy's joanne's fabric and um those are the only stores i bought stuff from i did go to ulta michaels and um kohl's which i didn't buy anything from any of those stores but like I was saying, this um, TV I picked up, I did go 6 o'clock in the morning. Well, I actually got there at 6.20 in the morning, Friday morning. Um, but Walmart still had about four of these TVs left. They had none, none of the 40 or 43-inch TVs that they had on sale. They had none of those. But they did have these ones as well as the 55-inch TVs left. So I went ahead and I per picked up two of them and these are the 4K UHD t smart TVs and a 65 inch and they were $400. So um, the next store I went to from there, I did go to Best Buy but they did not open up until 8 o'clock on Friday morning. So I said, well let me shoot down to the mall because I know Victoria's Secret was already open. They opened at 6 a.m. and they had $1 bath bombs, which I did want to scoop up because they're originally $6.95 and on sale there's typically two for five. So normally at $2.50 a piece. You know, sometimes they have a sale. Other than that, they did have items on sale, but those items were actually on sale all week. The only exclusive Black Friday item they had on sale was the bath bombs. So, I will go ahead and show you everything that I got from Victoria's Secret, but I will do that in a separate video just um, to try to make this video not as long. So, these are the two items that they also gave out, which is a blanket and a um, bag if you spent over $150 at Victoria's Secret. The next store I went to from there was Macy's and I picked up um, some sweaters. They had all of their sweaters on sale for Black Friday up until noon for $20 in their juniors department. So these are some of the sweaters that I picked up, which this one is just a very nice soft cow neck sweater with a drawstring in the front. Um, so I figured that would be really nice and cozy. Um, this one I really, really like. I think it's so cute. It's so bright red and it has Mickey Mouse on the front. So I love that sweater and like I said, it's very soft and cozy. I also picked up these knife sets. Um, they were on um, Black Friday sale for $14 and they're by um, this brand. I'm not even going to try to say the name because I might mess it up. But I've seen these around for so long and I've been wanting them. So I went ahead and grabbed them up, you know, for Black Friday. I also bought this frying pan, but I don't know. It was $20. I don't know how much cast iron frying pans normally cost, but that's a cast iron grilling one. I think it was probably originally like $50 or something. So I don't know how, you know, what I'm going to do with that one. But we'll see, um, you know, once I put everything away, if I find myself pulling it out in the next week or so, I'll go ahead and keep it. If not, uh, it'll probably go back. So anyhow, they also had all their Tommy Hilfiger on sale for 60% off. So I did get my son these um, little sweatpants and um, they end up being, I think, $13.99. I also bought a whole bunch of other Tommy Hilfiger stuff, which I have already placed into my children's closet. Sorry, but it was just like some zip up hoodies, some more pants and shirts and that type of stuff. I bought some for my daughter and my son. So, um, let me see. And I did buy them some other cute little clothes. They didn't have a lot of cute clothes, in my opinion, um, for the little girls. But I did manage to get this. And it's that really nice, soft material. Um, and that was also 60% off. I don't remember how much it ended up being. So, I also purchased 
this baking set for $20 because I do want to start baking with my daughter. Um, baking cakes and cupcakes and all that type of stuff. So that's why I went ahead and bought that. I thought that was really cute. And I think that's everything I got from Macy's. Oh, and also from Walmart, I keep forgetting, I did buy a small trampoline, uh, some other Christmas gifts for the kids, and um, the trampoline is for like the daycare, so I already let them use that, as well as like a little scooter car for the daycare for the little ones. So that's already pulled out and that's set up. They also had socks on sale for $5, undies, and pajamas. So I did pick up everyone some of those. Next from there, I went to Joanne's Fabric where I picked up a lot of the Cricut items. And I did pick up a Cricut Maker, which I'm really, really excited about. But I wish I would have got it off of H HSN because they had it for $10 more, which was $360. But you would have got like a bundle kit. So, and you would have got flex payments for free. So, I would have much rather do that. But... Whatever, we'll see if they have that deal again because that Cricut Maker will go back to Joanne's if I see that deal on HSN again. But anyway, they had a lot all their paper products on sale for 50% off. So I did pick up a lot of their vinyl, um, iron-on vinyl as well as their regular vinyl. And then I did pick up some planner products. This meal plan kit I picked up. I picked up the Super Mom. The Super Mom um, sticker book. I picked up these like adhesive to put on to clothes. I picked one up for um, my daughter and my son. And these were 50% off. So they were like $2.50 because they were like $5 um, regular price. So I picked up those. And I think that's everything I picked up from Joann's. And then I went to... Um, oh, I also picked up these Cricut mats. And 50% off, honestly, you can always use the 50% off people at Joann's or Michael's. So that's really nothing too major. But it was just easier for me to get everything all at once. So that's why I went ahead and just, you know, grabbed it. If I don't need it, I can always take it back. I have no shame in taking stuff back, guys. Like, no shame at all. So anyway, if I'm not using it, you know, because there's no need for me to just keep it. Um, so next, I did go to JCPenney's where I picked up um, this micro fleece. Is that what it says? No, it says fleece, fleece sheets. And they're super, super soft. They're like a blankety material. And I figured this will help my kids stay warm at night. They like to kick their um, big cover off. So I'm hoping if they have like a smaller sheet set and it's thicker and more blankety, that they'll keep that on them more than they do the, um, the big quilts. Um, I think that is it. And I didn't, I don't have down here the drone that I bought from, um, Walmart or the sound bar, but I did pick those items up. So I think that is it guys uh, I did buy this for my son from JC Penney's and this will be a Christmas gift. So I have to pack that up um, But I think that's it. So I hope that you guys like this video I'm so sorry if it was really fast. I'm talking fast and I didn't go to a lot of details but this is the second time me recording this so I just wanted to go ahead and get this stuff done before my kids start, you know <laughs> But all right, thank you guys for watching. I hope that you could subscribe, like the video, um, and leave a comment down below. It will help me get more views, basically, um, and be able to put out more videos or keep me motivated to put out more videos. Not that I'm going to fall off, but, you know, it helps. So, again, thank you guys for um, watching. I hope everyone had a happy holiday and continue to have a happy holiday throughout the holiday season. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.